Acor Orthopedic Educational Tutorial. My name is Ross Marty and I am Director of Clinical Education for Acor and I will be your instructor for this series. Now we need to open up the uh, Diapedia PIC software. Just double click on the icon there. Give it a second and we'll have a, an area to enter your, or your uh, um, password here, application password. And then it'll open up your uh, the software here. And you'll notice uh, on the main toolbar, there's uh, several different icons to choose from, which include uh, acquire data, review data, transmit data, system admin, exit, and help. We're going to start with the uh, acquire data. And you have the option of a new patient or returning patient. Let me show you both here real quick. Uh, new patient, just click on that. You're going to have to type in uh, all the spaces need to be filled in here. So we'll do a first name. Uh, let's make up something here. Um, you'll do, need, need to do a middle initial also. And an ID number. Um, you can make it up or if you have a system already, just put that in there. Also a birth date. And this just kind of keeps track of the patient. So it gives us three different options here. Once that's all filled in and complete, um, you'll want to open a new. And that's open the new thing that's going to ask you. You have chosen for a new record. Would you like to open this for Joe Bob? Yep. And now it brings us to the next segment. All right, for returning patient, just click on that. This is for the patient's last name. And that's the record I want, so I highlight it. You selected. You've chosen this patient, yes, and it'll bring you to the acquired data toolbar. Acquired data toolbar, you have several different things here. Uh, order of form is the first one. We will need to have you fill out an order form before you send it to us. Um, you can do it while the patient's there, or you can come back and do it afterwards. Just uh, highlight the returning patient and fill out the order form. Uh, 3D capture is the, the capture of the foam. We have a pressure mat also if you have that. I'll show you that in a minute. Transmit data and back and then of course help. Let's start with the 3D capture here. All right, click OK here. It'll just take a few minutes to initialize the scanner. Go to 3D Capture. You're going to want to put in here turntable delta of 45. Once you have that, just capture scan. Now the system will go through a series of commands. It'll first go to 45 degrees to the left, and it'll take a, a series of photos, and then you'll see here in a second, it'll take a 3D scan also. And there's the laser scan, taking the 3D scan. Once that scan is complete, it'll go to a horizontal position and take a, another series of photos. And once again, another 3D scan.
turntable will move 45 degrees to the right now. Series of photos there. And now the final 3D scan. Okay, and all of the three scans that we just took, and uh, once uh, you send this information, we'll put it into our software and combine all three scans into one complete picture. Okay, to capture your pressure mat impression, we just hit pressure mat. It's going to do a test real quick. And then you notice we'll have a left and a right. So I'm going to do a left scan here real quick. And when I click on left scan, you'll hear two tones. A higher pitch tone, that means go. And then a lower pitch tone, that means you should be done. You should be done. So let's do this real quick. And just walk across it nice and normal. And you'll see that the pressure goes up. You can do this a couple times. So let's do it again real quick. Scan left foot. Nice and natural. Once you're done there, you can look at the scan. And you'll do the same for the right foot. Alright, so you'll notice how I have two scans here. You can do up to five. I recommend to have at least two so you can see some difference. I typically do three, but for this I'll show just two. Once you have those, you'll hit save. And it'll save all the information and you want to go back to your toolbar. Okay, now that we've captured the data, we've also filled out our order form. We're going to hit transmit data. You will not be able to do this unless you filled out an order form. So we've got that filled out. Everything's ready to go. We have an area here to fill out any additional text. It shows that everything's contained here. I've got my scans. I've got my order form. Um, there's any, uh, some other information over here for immediate use or whatever. Um, we'll just, once you're done there, we'll just send it. For more information on what you've seen here today, or to watch another ACOR educational tutorial, visit us at www.acor.com. Thanks for watching and good day.